Alright, what is going on guys? Welcome back again to another video. A new video every week and this week we're gonna take a look at Lin Fei. Lin Fei is an awesome legend with the Qatars and the cannon. As you may know, I'm not a really great cannon player but I am quite good with the Qatars. So it's gonna be a good video either way. And I found some cool combos with both of these weapons. So I think you're really gonna learn something from this. But before we get into it, only a very small percentage of you guys watching are actually subscribed to my channel. So if you want to, please subscribe and also leave a like and then let's get on with the video. So first of all, as always, we're going to take a look at Lin Fei's main attacks. Of course, she has three main attacks with each of the weapons, the side stick, the down stick and the neutral signature. First off, the side signature, just like this. This side stick, it's quite decent. The damage is quite low, but overall, the range is good. Um, the speed is, is nice. Only thing is, don't stand too close, then you're gonna miss it. But other than that, it's decent enough. Then the down stick like this. This one is nice for edge guarding and stuff like that. It's it's a decent down stick, but the problem with it is, it's quite slow. It takes a while before the real attack starts. So, in that case, it's not really great, but it's not terrible. Then the neutral stick like this. This one is quite interesting. You can hit this one from the ground up or from the air up. It hits diagonally above you, which is always quite a nice hitbox. With this one as well, the damage is quite low, but this one is quite useful. Alright, then we move on to the Qatars. First of the side signature, like this. As you see, this one has quite high damage, which is really nice. If you hit this one from a little bit farther away, you're only gonna hit the last part and do a lot less damage, but still quite nice. You can hit this one from really close by. The speed is okay, so this is a nice side signature. Then the down stick like this. This one is quite interesting because it's a really special side stick. Not a lot of attacks are like this. This one's nice for edge guarding as well. This one does take a little bit of getting used to. The damage isn't that high, but overall I do like this down signature. But you just need to get used to it a little bit, see in what situations this one works very well. Then the neutral signature, last but not least. This one has kind of a hitbox like just around you and inside you. You can also use this one when someone comes from the top, but then it's a little bit hard to hit as you move forward a little bit while doing it. But overall, I do like this neutral signature as well. We're gonna start off with the combos with the cannon, and this first combo is actually gonna be very amazing because it's a true combo. This means it can't be dodged. This combo is gonna be a downlight into a neutral signature, something like this. As you can see, there were some dodge windows on that one, but if you perform it correctly, like this, you see zero dodge windows. This means people can dodge this one, and it's actually very easy to perform, so it's a really great combo. Everybody who plays Lin Fei should know this one. If you hit the downlight, just do the neutral stick afterwards, they can't do anything about this, and you will always do some really nice damage, and you can even kill your enemy maybe with it. Alright, then for the second combo with the cannon, this one's gonna be a down air into a side light into a neutral signature. It's gonna look something like this. As you see, pretty cool combo. You can get this one actually to very low dodge windows to both below 5, which is really great, almost impossible to dodge for your enemies. So this is gonna be a really cool combo you really wanna use when you play Lin Fei with the cannon. But you do need to work on it, it's pretty easy to miss this one and it's also pretty easy to get high dodge winners on this one. So you do really need to get the timing perfect if you want to use this one. But once you master this combo, it's going to be a very great asset to when you're playing Lin Fei. Then we're on to the Qatars. This first combo is going to be very easy as it's just a side light into a neutral signature like this. This combo is very easy to do but it's very low dodge windows so it's a really great one to know around two dodge windows you can get them consistently maybe even one dodge window but it's great to know this one nothing too special about it but you do really want to know it if you want to try to play Lin Fei. now we're gonna get into a little bit of a harder combo it's gonna be a down air into a side light, into a neutral light, into a down light, into a gravity cancel neutral signature. If you do not know what the gravity cancel is, please check out the first video, link down below in the description. It's a video explaining all the basic things about Brawlhalla like gravity cancels, chase dodging, stuff like that. 
but if you got all that, the combos are gonna look something like this. As you see, really cool combo from white to orange damage instantly, which is really great. A lot of damage packed into one small combo. And the dodge windows are actually quite decent on this one. The last part has a little bit higher dodge windows, but overall it's still a really great combo and you really should try it out against your enemies in game and see if it works for you. That was it again for this week's video. For my overall thoughts about Lane Fei, I think she's a cool legend. I don't use her that much because she has the cannon and I don't really play cannon. But I think if you're a newer player and you want to try her out, you should. If you were a longer time player and you want to try it, sure you should. She's not a bad character or anything. She's not one of the best either, if you ask me, but she's decent enough. Well, that was it again for this week's video. I really hope you liked it and you learned something from it. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.